Hello and welcome to the chart of the week video with me, Dave Madden. Today's date is Thursday, the 13th of December 2018, and the time is just gone 1010 GMT. This week's chart of the week is Palladium, and as you can see here, uh, taking a longer view on the, on the, on the chart on the market, we can see that um, the Palladium market has been in a solid upward trend since August. Um, a classic example towards the end here of, of higher highs and higher lows. And we're currently trading um, at 1202.4. Um, uh, we're not too far away from the record high that was set last week. So that, that's a good indication of how bullish um, the, this, this market it is. Uh, taking a look at the MACD indi indicator, the MACD histogram down here, we can see that as the market is edging higher here, we can see a, a, a slight increase in positive momentum. So the upward move we're seeing in the in, in the in the actual market itself is being confirmed by the steady increase in positive momentum so the bulls are, are, are very much in control if you look to press if you look to take take out uh last week's record high uh just north of 1205 we could be looking at targeting the 1230 region now where where, where i got that um that uh, rough uh, price target from uh was it by taking a look uh, at the upper, at the risk, at the by measuring uh, the upward uh, upward moves that we've seen in recent weeks and project and get, getting an average and projecting upwards. So if you take a take an average of the various up, different upward moves, so if you measure the upward move from here to here, from here to here, and from this low to this high here, uh, if you take an average of those three upward moves, <clears throat> they rallied uh, on average eighty six eighty six dollar eighty six dollars. Uh, per upward move, and starting with the uh, with, with the with the, uh, with the base here, with, with the low here in the 11.42 region, and projecting upwards, 86 dollars, that'll bring us to in around uh, 12.30. So this is a rough projection of what we could potentially see should the uh, the, the upward trend that Palladium has been in for recent, for a number of months now continues. On the other hand, if Palladium does manage to drift a bit, drift a bit lower, we could see some fresh buyers enter the fold, and we could see um, support come into play in around the 11.42, 11.37 region here. If the market drips, drips, drops even below that again, we could see the mar we could see the fifth of the day moving average come into play. This blue line here, which comes into play at 11.11, 11, uh, and a move below that might bring 11.00 into play. The market's been in a solid upward trend for a number of months, and so and buying on the dip has been a popular strategy. So these, these are the areas that we could potentially see the market drift back to should there be a bit of a downward pressure. A break below 1100 could point to uh, to, to further losses. Um, just before I finish up this video, uh, if you want to make any any comments on this video or any of the other videos we've made here at CMC Markets, please feel free to leave a review on Google Reviews. And that's all for me, for me this week. Thank you very much.